Hi, I'm Suzanne Little Stefanik. I live in Adams, Massachusetts. I'm from the Berkshires. This is my creation for Catamount Prowls in Bennington, Vermont, 2013. The name of it is Vermont Glory. I kind of came up with a, the plan to paint the cat realistic. Um, understanding that the catamount is now considered extinct, I thought it would be nice to see what a catamount actually looks like. Um, I was also inspired by the beauty of Vermont and reflected that in the base, um, showing four different seasons going all the way around the bottom. You can see here, this is the winter. Fall is in the front. Summer and then spring. I've done several events with Bennington ranging from the two Moose Fest to uh, the Pallet Fest. And now uh, this is my fourth event. With it being the first one of the event, um, it was kind of kicking off the Catamount, Catamount Prowl event. Um, I wanted it to have a good taste of what Vermont is about and um, all the beauty that you see in the state. I wanted it to reflect on this piece. I think that Vermont is really beautiful with the four seasons. And I wanted that to show on the base. Not only is each uh, picture reflected of each season, but also in between each picture is um, the background is the trees and how they look in each season. Well, there are a couple of the landmarks. One is the Bennington uh, Monument and also one of the covered bridges is uh, reflected here. Um, I never really kept track of the hours that it took because I would work on it for a few hours and then I'd let, let it just sat, you know, kind of stand back and look at it and see what I was going to do next. Um, I did a lot of dry brush technique on the cat to kind of give it a little bit of a fur type of look. And I started from the paws and I worked my way up. And um, the last part I did was the fur on the belly. In hindsight, no, um, I was happy with the idea and the way it came out. I think originally I was thinking about uh, painting the cat to look like the sky. Um, with the view of the town below. Um, but after doing research on a catamount, I um, decided it would be really cool to show what a catamount really looks like. I am um, a professional artist. I work freelance right now. Um, because of word of mouth, I, I get a lot of different types of jobs, basically painting um, with acrylic. And I also do purple cow ornaments for the Williams shop in Williamstown, Mass. Um, and that's a year-round adventure. Um, and I, I do a lot of different miscellaneous artwork. I think the only piece, there was a piece that was cut off on the other side that um, it was done so it would fit into a doorway. The original sculpture was a little bit too wide to fit it through an average doorway. So they had sliced a piece of it off to make it a little narrower. Um, so I ended up working on that one piece separately and then piecing it back together at the end. I would definitely do it again if they end up doing a, a catamount prowl again. I would be the first one to sign up. <laughs>